starting at Rockbound Lake. Trailhead, and it takes 8.4K to get there. Fortunately, no bikes. Well, I've made it to Rockbound Lake. See, there's Castle Mountain. I've already done that. And I've done Helena Ridge. So, Stuart Knob and Television Peak or TV Peak just beyond out of sight. Just walking along the shore here. It's just beautiful. I uh, noticed that there's some snow up there, so I am going to probably get a little wet because I wore approach shoes instead of my waterproof ones, but that's okay. It's gonna be a long day. Continue walking up the shore and then I'm gonna reach this drainage and then start traversing left to make it through Cliff Band. Here's where the water from the lake drains into the abyss. Well, don't get much better than this. Hiking along this nice trail. It's pretty amazing. Stewart Knob is sticking out kind of between those peaks. This is the cliff band I gotta overcome. It's beautiful hiking through here. Alright, I'm up above and at the back of the lake. And here is the weakness that I'm gonna scramble up and then make my way to Stewart Knob. It's a pretty nice approach. Making my way up to the trail. Scree or talus slope. What you want to do is you want to aim to get to the left and go around the other side and scramble up. Use from the other side. So I approach the summit. views of the other side now looking over at the Lake Louise group and that's TV peak oh my god it's so far it's gonna be quite the day well here's the scrambling section on Stewart Knob and there is some ice so I just have to be careful I'm gonna come to the side here and scramble up the drier parts on the summit of Stewart Knob Pretty awesome.
next peak right behind me. It's gonna be quite the slog to get over there. You can see Cynthia on the summit of Stewart Knob. It's nice to meet her. Just made the first bump. Now we gotta, you can see the ridge. We scramble all the way up. to gain the ridge. Television peak. Awesome. here just next to the repeater building here out of the wind it's a lot of effort to do these two peaks now I'm all done and I'm gonna be descending down to the Bow Valley Parkway just below this repeater here it's for competent scramblers it says so there's a small down climb, which is the crux. So, interested to see what that looks like. Gorgeous day. Super stoked. Super windy. Well, the down climb down to the highway was all ice and snow, so I couldn't do it safely, so now I gotta backtrack and go down the same way I came up, so it's gonna be a long day, longer than anticipated, but just be safe. Cheers. Sunset. Hiking in the dark. 